Hello researchers, how are you? I hope you are fine and doing well. In this video, I am going to demonstrate a newly received Guan Instec based DSO. DSO stands for Digital Signal Oscilloscope. Now this video will be primarily focused on making you aware regarding the DSO technology, unboxing of a DSO as well as giving you some review of that DSO which I am going to give you an out of box. So now you can see there is a box which appears of GW Instec. So if I rotate this box, it's again say GW Instec, GW Instec.com and all these uh, logos and again it says GW Instec. And in the last over here, I can see that GW Instec lifetime warranty digital storage oscilloscope. The model is GDS1072U. So let us unbox it. So I'm using my pair of scissors and let me unbox it. So the box is unboxed. So the first thing which I've got is the manual as well as some CDs which I've got that is uh, says G uh, GW Instec and it contains the software which I will be using for installing it and capturing some uh, 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 you can say signal images onto my computer and here is the manual which says digital storage oscilloscope GDS 1000 U series so again it bears a very good uh, manual IP so so let's don't uh, go into depth of this and this says the instructions so all the probes how to manage the signals everything is being managed in this manner so let's see what's next in this box the next I find is the crocodile cable so I think so that it is two channel digital also scope so it will be having two channels so this is the crocodile cable and this is the connector which we will be using in the oscilloscope so the next which I have got is the power cable which is going to uh, give the power to my digital oscilloscope so fully loaded device so again I have got another crocodile cable over here and uh, this one connector for uh, miscellaneous purpose again it says the menu that is probe rod probe tip ground lead marketer ring tip locating sleeve adjusting tool so now let us unbox the digital oscilloscope So here it comes out from the box. So very nice digital oscilloscope. Quite heavy I think so. So here. So here in my hand a digital signal oscilloscope. So first of all what you have to do is to adjust this. Bring this two out and move it like this. So it will be automatically locking it. So this is the power button. This is the USB where you can uh, plug in your USB pen drive for capturing the images. This is for measuring 2 volt current. This is for signals channel 1, channel 2, exit trick, auto set, variable, channel 1, channel 2, math, menu and all these type of triggers. So let us start with some opening of this uh, digital signal oscilloscope. So let me power on this by putting this cable at the back of it located right here like this and let me power on with my extension so the power has come so let us on this with this switch so you can see digital storage oscilloscope GDS 1000 U series Gwen Instec simply reliable GWinstec.com so let me bring the crocodile cable with me so now you can see the menu has come which it contains of a good graph so what I do I just press down this cable you can find this connector place it over here and now let us connect this signal to over here so auto set processing has been done and uh, you can find the signals are coming so if I make I want to make the signal big I can use this if I want to make the signal low I can use this so even I can set the volts and if I want to take some help I can take from these buttons like shaping coupling and rejection noise rejection previous menu all these auto sets are there so if I click on auto set it goes with auto set processing and uh, if I want to have, have the help, I can run and stop it. So again, I press on run, it is triggered. 
So uh, this is a very cool device for electronics engineers to have the digital signal oscilloscope. So in this video I have demonstrated the unboxing of GW Instec GDS 1072U which is a 70 MHz digital oscilloscope, a state of the art technology and uh, I recommend that if you are an electronics engineer do purchase this equipment you will be using this equipment for various sorts of projects for uh, various sort of uh, project developments so these all options are with you it's a very advanced oscilloscope thank you so much